Isaac's mother replied. Hello everyone, how's it going? And welcome to the Binding of Isaac Anti-Birth. Couple of things real quick. Uh, I did skip the intro, but it's exactly the same as the old intro, except it's narrated by a very British man. Isaac and his mum. I don't know, I love that dude's voice. So, this is a ginormous expansion mod thingy for the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. And I say specifically Rebirth because, weirdly enough, it doesn't actually have the Afterbirth content in it yet. They are planning to add that apparently. Now, I've played a little tiny bit of this. I do mean a tiny bit and seen a tiny bit more. So, the majority of this, uh, majority of this if I can speak English, I haven't seen. Uh, do let me know if there's any mic issues because... A lot of people were having the same mic issue that they were having with the original Rebirth. I did check, the setting seems fine, so the mic shouldn't be cracking and popping like, you know, Rice Krispies. But if it is, do let me know so I can fix it as soon as I can. And hello everyone in chat, how you doing? Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, etc, etc. Alright, so, let's just jump on in here. Now, I'm gonna pick this file. This one, I think, is my main file. I'm not gonna even mess around with that, because uh, I don't want to you know, potentially bugger up my progress with the Lost and the Keeper and what have you. I'm hoping it's not buggering that up anyway, because you actually have to uninstall the Afterbirth DLC to get Antibirth to work. So, there is that. Uh, so we're going to use this other file, which almost has the Polaroid and the negative unlocked, I think. So, this way we should be able to see a lot more of the new content, because apparently you have to beat the game at least once uh, for a lot of the new stuff to show up. So, yes. All I know is there's... There's like new alternate floors, I think like a new path through the game with a new ending, new bosses, new enemies, new items, stuff like that. So there you go, thank you for the host Dandelion. Alright, uh, we're gonna look challenge number three, Turbo. Are there any new challenges? I don't remember a challenge being called Turbo. Wait, it said three Turbo, right? What? Oh yeah! Ah! Huh. That's cool. So why is number 1 and 10 coming soon? Oh, and 5 and 6 and 7. So there is 1, 2, 3, wait, no, 2, 3, 4, 8 and 9. So it has specific new uh, new challenges. Very interesting indeed. We are going to do a, I guess a hard mode run? I mean, sure? Oh, and there are new characters as well. I don't think I said that. There's Bethany unlocked by having 12 so hard, good God. And Jacob. Jacob, uh, who we don't know how to unlock. Fair enough then, fair enough. By the way, there's not going to be that many people in the chat today, I think, just because a lot of them that usually would be here are playing Overwatch. Uh, so I should point out, Kirsty and Reaper are both streaming Overwatch, as is Jordan, aka School of the Wolf. So if you'd rather watch Overwatch, I'm going to hold it against you. You can go check out one of those. And uh, as you can see, Nightbot just put a more Twitch link in the chat, so you can watch me and her at the same time, should you wish to do so. If you want, just put slash XX Souls Reaper XX at the end there, and you'll be able to watch him and whoever the hell else you want as well. So, since we don't have the new characters, could try an Eden run. Let's try an Eden run. I think we should go a normal, though, just because, you know, I haven't played this game in, like, at least six months. At least. I'm going to be rusty as balls. We appear to have a new book, I think? Basement 1. Oh, by the way... You can see on the left there, I think it's F6 to do that? Yes, F6 to bring up the extra stats. Basically, that's a more accurate representation of what your stats actually are. And I think F7? Yes. F7 shows you the items on the right like uh, they added in Afterbirth. And by the way, I'm probably going to mix up the words Afterbirth and Antibirth all of the time. So we have Bumbo. Or Friendly but That's Bumbo. No, not Bumbo. Is that Bumbo? What's his damn name? I can't remember his name. Isn't just like bum fr bum friend, right? That's bum friend. Uh, so we have this book. This looks like a book that was in Community Remix, I think. Blood something or other. I mean, it's pretty obvious from the description on the uh, cover. Well, it's not a description, but the picture. To tell the truth, I hate your Overwatch stream. Damn, <laughs> you just don't like the game. Yeah, I know. I I have been streaming Overwatch a lot. What does this do? Oh, we don't even know the name of it. Does it give me tears up? Maybe. Oh, by the way, I should probably show the seed just in case you can't use them. A2D1ED0V. It's all beautiful and rhyming and stuff. Hello, Alex. How you doing, buddy? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to do a less Overwatch on... Uh, I, I put it this way. I love Overwatch, quite clearly, because I streamed it and played it a lot. I think I have like 400 hours in that game. I, too, am getting sick of it. That's not to say it's bad. That's not to say I'm never going to play it again. But, like, I, I can't play it six hours a day like Kirsty can. So... 
Yeah, no. Rather than play Overwatch with them right now, we're going to do this for a couple of hours. Then I'll probably play Overwatch with them, probably once I've ended my stream, because the stream probably will only be uh, after birth, anti-birth today. And uh, I'll just do the, the Overwatch stuff off camera, in a way. I mean, you can always see what I'm doing through, you know, Reaper or Kirsty's eyes. Uh, don't want to go to the curse room. Sure, let's give it a try. Give me good things. Yay! Worth it. Puberty. Doesn't do anything. And speed up. Good. Got plus a 0.15 speed. I'll leave that stats up there. Oh, hello. Uh, getting an extra bomb to get to that. I'll leave the stats on the screen. Uh, if they really are bothering anyone, I can turn them off. I I don't know how I feel about them, to be honest. I'm probably mostly just not even going to look at them, so I don't really care. And I, yeah, I would imagine most people will probably want them there rather than not want them. And the majority of people are probably just going to be like me and just completely impartial. Does anyone remember what this book does? Because again, Community Remix, for those who don't know, was a large mod uh, expansion thing for the original Binding of Isaac. Which came out, I think, either shortly before or shortly after uh, the Rebirth came out. And I'm pretty bloody sure this book was in it. And on my test run that I did yesterday... Again, when I was, oh shit, when I was trying to make sure it worked and blah blah blah, and just make sure I didn't suck horribly on the first run, though we're, we're kind of sucking horribly anyway, uh, I did get a couple of items that I saw in Community Remix. One was like uh, a trinket, and the other one was a regular item, so I don't know if this is by the same people that make Community Remix, or if they've just taken inspiration from some of the items, I have no idea, but all I know is this is a massive, massive mod. Like humongous, like probably adds more content than Afterbirth did. But again, don't forget we don't have the Afterbirth content because it hasn't mixed in yet. So this is Rebirth with this on top, not the Afterbirth DLC. Confusing, I know, but you'll get used to it, maybe. And like I say, they are planning to uh, add in the Afterbirth content uh, at some point. Uh, I really want to get that Tinder Rock, but we need another bomb to get to that. We could look for a secret room instead. There's Two places it could be... I think I'm just going to save my bomb. Oh, and it is a tears up. Okay, thank you. It said temporary... It did it? Oh. Guess I completely missed that. Now, I will try to remember not to skip the uh, the boss cutscenes so we can see the names of new bosses should they show up. Apparently, we have a 100% chance for a deal with the devil right now. Makes sense. And yes, it does show your devil and angel chances. So if we get hit, it's going to go down bloody substantially. So it's trying to... Well, if we take red heart damage... Just trying to do that. Come hither, buddy. Come hither. Oh my god, why? Why? Yeah, there you go. Uh, I mean, we could charge the book with that, but... Eh. Tempting as well to... Uh... I should charge the book before I came in here. Blow up, buddy. Blow up. Yeah! I should have probably gone to get another charge on the book before I came in here. Did I just say that twice in a row? I think I did. I think I went to, like, interrupt myself, and then I didn't interrupt myself, and I thought I had my break. Like, I just woke up. What do you want from me? So reason I thought this guy was from um, from the Afterbirth DLC, I guess not. Boop! That's a much better tempted rock. Well, kind of. Get out of here, spiders! Get out of here! Yeah, I feel, I feel so rusty. So rusty. You like the stats overlay? You wish the base game had it. Yes. Here's the thing. Um, <laughs> for those that don't know, there's actually another DLC coming out for... Uh, for the Binding of Isaac, like, uh, for Rebirth, like an official DLC, not in, you know, a mod expansion thingy, uh, called Afterbirth Plus. Excuse me, I had to cough. It's called Afterbirth Plus. It's actually coming out January 3rd, so, like, just over a week away. So, yeah. I mean, we're obviously going to be playing that when it comes out. Yeah, get it, Bumbo, or whatever your damn name is, bum friend. Give me things. I like you. You smart, you loyal, you can stay. For now. Uh, that's okay, it's not too bad. Ah! Okie dokie. So obviously we're going to be playing uh, the, the official expansion when it comes out. What I might do is just sort of do, like, alternate them. Like, alternate streams of this and Afterbirth Plus or something like that. Because I want to play them both. Uh, yeah. And the other thing is, with the Afterbirth Plus expansion, they're adding... Uh, like a toolkit for people to mod, kind of like the creation kit for, you know, Elder Scrolls games and what have you. Fallout, Skyrim, etc. So, what that means is, things like this will be a lot... Uh, not necessarily easier to do, because, you know, you still need 
artists and people that know how to program and blah blah blah, but it's still theoretically going to be easier to mod the game. And I do believe at some point Edmund and Tyrone, the kind of main guys behind The Binding of Isaac, said something along the lines of, if they like modded content, they might just add it to the regular game. Uh, so, what I'm trying to get at here is don't necessarily be surprised if this just ends up getting added to the regular game. At least the majority of it, because from the little bit that I've seen, it's actually really, really good quality. Like, I saw a couple of new bosses, and holy crap. Like, they, they look like they could be official. Like, there's, there's nothing about them where I'm like, eh, that, that animation or whatever looks a bit wonky. Like, it, genuinely, like, really impressive stuff here. So, do not be surprised at all if this just becomes a part of the regular game at some point down the line. Yoink. Right. Oh, Lord. What the hell are you? Ay, ay. Okay. It's a new enemy. They're making fart sounds! Oh, by the way, how, how is the uh, the sound balance? Am I too loud, too quiet? Is the music too loud, too quiet? Or is it good? It should be mostly fine, I think. Are these, like, actual floating buttholes? Oh, God! Are they not? Hang on, I need to test this. I don't think they do contact damage. I think they just, like, bounce you around. If they put, you, put them in a room with, like, spikes or something, they could be insanely dangerous. Why won't you die, you turd nuggets? I mean, chocolate drops. They're much less disgusting if you think of them like that. Uh, I see we gotta look for the cigar room. You know what? It's really bugging me that this turd's almost dead. There we go. Now I'm happy. I'm not OCD at all, I swear. Right. It's probably not there. It's usually surrounded by three rooms, not four. So it is probably... Yeah. I sh well, no, I couldn't really put the bomb there because... I was getting the tinted rock. Sounds good, thank you. Is that shielded tears? Yes. Eh? Okay. Uh, we'll blow up the shrooms. Why not? Manly! How's it going, dude? Two more pills. Don't be bad. Don't be bad. Tears up! I like it. I like it. Shielded tears is, uh, you know, sometimes amazing, sometimes really kind of annoying. Because, uh, you know... I think it basically the tier gets destroyed on enemy projectiles. So sometimes where you'll be having a fight with an enemy that's shooting at you a lot, and you, you're just basically cancelling out each other's tiers, so you're not hitting them. So... I would imagine if you get piercing shots, it would probably go through them? In which case it would make them amazing. Surely it would... well, no. How would that work? Would it go through them and destroy them? Because, I mean, the whole point of it is that it's a shield. I have no idea. Alright, anyway, we found the cigar room. Try to figure out where the other one is. One, two, three, four. I see at least five places the other secret room could be. I don't like those odds. I think it's usually near the boss, so we'll try the uh, try the wall over here. Again, I'm I'm basing this on like regular game logic. I don't know if they've messed around with anything like that. I really have no idea. Boop. Hello, Zanama and Noshi and Dandelion and Altair and Alex and everybody else. I loved you. How's it going? Near piercing shots for it to be god tier. Yeah, that's kind of what I thought. Merry Christmas, everybody, even though you don't celebrate it. Thank you, buddy. Happy holidays to you. I didn't get to see that. It said baby something or other. I mean, it was up long enough so that you can kind of see it. Oh, Jesus. But yeah, it's, it's going to be forced to have it skipping the, uh, the boss intros. So we have a new boss. This excites me. Oh, Lord. You see? <laughs> hey, okay. Oh, yeah, I've got a little... What's his name? Brimstone. Let's use him. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, he goes a lot of ham. Might be harder than uh, the regular game. Just gonna throw that one out there. Jesus. I mean, this is a basement boss, I remind you. I'm actually gonna leave that there for now. Oh, ghost baby. Oh, I mean, I'll take you. I ain't happy about it, though. All right, there goes my deal with the angel chance. I'm okay with that. Yoink. Man, there are hearts everywhere. Then again, I guess we are playing on normal. And uh, you get way less red heart drops on hard. But again, since we're so rusty, didn't think it was a good idea, good idea to jump in on uh, on hard. So, if we get, what, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, man, 12 soul hearts. That's, that's a full bar of soul hearts, isn't it? That's not going to be easy to do to unlock, uh, what was it, Bethany, I think her name was? Pissing shots lets your tears destroy multiple shots. Oh, that's a good point, yeah. Hey, how's it, how's it going? I'm gonna die now. Again, I know there are alternate paths and things like that. Uh, I don't know exactly how you access them. And I don't know exactly how much you have to unlock to do that. We, I think, almost have the Polaroid in the negative on this file, so it's it's not my main file, but it's 
we got a fair amount unlocked, so... Yeah, even if we do still have to do some of the regular game to get there, you know, at least there's new content in the meantime. Oh my god, I hate freaking wizard shots. Oh, that's right, I have this... I keep forgetting I have a little brimstone. Uh, the anal bead, rosary bead, faith up. Gives you a higher chance for angel deal or something, I think? Or does it give you more, uh... What the hell are they called? Eternal hearts? Something like that? I can't remember. It's one of the two, I think. There's still some items in the regular game that I'm not 100% sure what they ever did, but I'm pretty sure it's one of those two, maybe even both. Uh, not that we can get angel deals even with this thing now, because we didn't renounce the devil. The angel, you know, they don't like you. They don't like you if you don't renounce the devil. Where are you dying? Jesus. Did I kill them all? No, the doors are... Oh, hi. Why are you gray? You a key man? I'd like to not destroy you over somewhere I can't get to. Give me a key. Yeah. He's a key man, alright. Check out the music, by the way. Wait, the stream froze for you? Hold the phone. Let me make sure... Oh, why is my character auto-walking? Let me see if I can pull it up to make sure it's okay. One second. Okay, so it froze for like three of you, but only for a few seconds. Yeah, okay, I'm going to keep the stream up on my phone. That's really weird, because I haven't dropped any frames. And I didn't, like, freeze in the game, so... Yeah. I have no idea why that happened. That's... Do you let me know if that if that's a thing that keeps cropping up? Don't know how I would how I would deal with that. By the way, this is a new color champion. I don't know what it means, but I'm a little scared. Die! Yeah. Oh god. Okay. Get out of here. Get out of here. Man, we need some. Oh, we need some more damage. I'm feeling weak. We need to use a little brimstone when I am though. Oh hi, we found the boss. Am I worth just trying the boss now? Okay. Sure, don't skip the intro. Mega more. Alright. It's an old boss, it's fine. It's clobbering. These shots should actually be oh pretty good for this guy. Assuming we can destroy his fires? I would imagine so. We can. That's pretty damn handy. Ah Jesus. What's he doing? Huh? <laughs> He's just dying. So we only got a 1 in 3 chance of getting a devil deal. You wanna... You wanna give me one anyway, game? You unlock the catacombs! Really? Really? I didn't have them? What? Don't you have to fight like every boss in the caves or something to unlock the catacombs? Was I just miss... I guess I was missing Mega Moore if that's the case. Interesting. Okay, well, we got the catacombs. Wait, 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 wait. Catacombs. Oh yeah, catacombs. That's right, never mind. Catacombs was a, a rebirth thing. Why? What the hell are you? I kind of just want to see what he does. Is he just a champion? Maybe he's just a champion. I think he is. Ah! Yeah, okay, so he's just a red heart champion. Alright. Yay, we got a dime that's top of the line. With a tiny waist and a big behind. He looked like a normal champion that shoots occasional shots. Wait, what are we talking about here? Oh my god. Oh, you mean the, uh, the purple worm thing. Yeah, it did just seem to shoot. Holy crap. Come back. Ah. Okay, yeah, we need damage, man. Yeah, I mean, if we can get blow Brimstone off, we're still doing good damage, but uh, a lot of enemies like that are very evasive, so it's kind of hard. Alright, let's see if we can find our treasure room, because I want to, I want new booty. The pink maggot, yeah. Ah, uh, I guess it could be a secret room here. We only have two bombs, though. Actually, looking at the map, at least so far, it could be in many places. We could bomb over here to get this key, but we are pretty good on keys right now. Okay, that's not the way you leave the room. Almost walk straight on that. And we get like a book of revelations or something. Or I guess this plays like blue baiting get really lo Oh god. Really lucky. Holy crap. What is with these spiders, man? I was so focused on the bony I didn't realize these things were new. Oh god, why? Okay, bony is dead. Kill the thing. Kill the thing. Jeez. Those things are quite dangerous. What's in here? No greed. BFF. That makes your friends better. That's really good, considering we have no damage and we have, you know, a couple of familiars. No. Don't mind if I do. I suppose I should try and put money in the machine. See if we can get it back up to 100. 
This is fun, ain't it? I mean, at some point we'll probably uh, play this on the main file when they do add the uh, the Afterbirth DLC. Like I said, I would really be surprised if they don't... Oh, tears to... Oh. I'd really be surprised if they don't, at some point, uh, add this to the base game. Like Edmund mentioned, he would do if he thought a mod was really good, because this is, this is some high-quality shit, man. And hello, Big Bird. How are you, sir? You have come from the co-op stream of mess. You mean the uh, the Overwatch thing? How's that going? Yeah, without our, like, buddies, we are doing jack shit damage. Oh, well, why not have another friend? I don't remember her having that derpy face. Have they, like, reskinned her slightly? I don't know. What's in here? Gotta do it, ain't you, really? Gotta do it. Oh, hello. Oh, Lord, why? No. Did an explosion just go off? What was that? Like, before the bomb? I suppose it was like some kind of ground slam thing that just happened. This is actually really good with BFF, like what we go on, got going on here. Like our, our Isaac character, Eden, whatever you want to call him, he's a bit shit. But all our followers are doing like all the damage. Yeah, he actually charges really quick, little Brimstone. Like I always underestimate how quickly you can just pepper with him. How fast is Ah, oh, it's not as fast as I thought, never mind. Yeah, it's still pretty good. The Overwatch stuff is going well, although they are eerily calm. That's creepy. Ah. But yes, I will be joining them in Overwatch or whatever they're playing when I'm done here. I'm probably only going to go for like two hours or something. It's going to be a shorter stream than, you know, the three that we normally do. Frankly, because I want to eat, and then I will be joining them. And, you know, I don't want to just stream solo the entire day and just be like, well, you know, screw my friends. No. I do want to spend time with them, but I really want to play this. We'll keep the Hematomesis pill because that will, you know, drop a bunch of red hearts for us. It costs us hearts, but if we do it when we're low on HP, then it's just free HP. Holy crap. Holy crap. Taking way too much damage, man. Way too much damage. Oh, Lord. Well, again, if these things don't actually do contact damage... No, they look different. They look like a skull. Yeah, they, uh, they explode into, like, green gas. Okay. Sorry, I was just listening to the music. So I don't think there's going to be Sigurum um, here because there were rocks blocking one of the walls. And that's usually a good sign that you can't go in there. Because it, it has to be clear from like every entrance. So it's going to be either this one on the left or the one on the right. So sure, we have a couple of bombs, we'll try it. Yay! Yay! Give me things. Oh, that's actually quite a lot of money. I like it. Sure, if we put a bomb there, do we get at least two of them? Yes, we do, but we didn't get anything. Well, fair enough. Touche, I guess. Can't win them all. Where is the shop? Shop's down there. I can't remember if we had more money to donate and the machine capped out or what. Because, again, I would like to get up to 100 if we can, at least for now. Yeah, okay. See if we can get... Ah, you bastard. Oh, I put my luck up. So that's the thing that's... Um... Oh, I didn't realize that. I thought you only had to donate one coin to get the luck upgrade. Maybe you have to cap out the machine to get the luck upgrade? Oh. Interesting. Didn't know that. Well, there you go. That's why the uh, the HUD thing is very handy. So we have one luck now. It's a lot better than zero. Alright. Let go! Must remember not to skip boss intros. Need to try. Very bad at trying. Sure, since the book's charged through a big room. Oh, lord. Yeah! <laughs> God damn it. This is like one problem with having piercing shots with uh, little brimstone is you destroy like eight enemies like that and explode into bullets and you get eight times as many bullets that you have to dodge than if you just kill them one at a time. Oh, we got a double key room. Your little sister says hi everyone. Hello Dandelion's little sister. How are you doing? Oh, thanks Bumbo. I'm just gonna call you Bumbo. There's a game by the way being worked on by uh, the people that made this called The Legend of Bumbo. I don't know what it is exactly. He described it as kind of like a... It's roguelike-ish, like this game is. He says like a cross between this and a puzzle game. So, take that from what you for what you will. He said it's like a, a way less luck-based version of this game, in a way. That's not new, that's not new at all. Wait a minute, Tempor temporary min man pack. Oh. I thought it said mini pack, and I was like, what? I don't remember saying that, and that's because it didn't. I read it wrong, because I'm an idiot. Oh, hi, Floating Heads of Death. Ha-ha! 
Yeah, our little broomstone is kicking ass, man. She's doing well. Good. Oh, no, 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 no. Um... Part of me is tempted just to go straight to the boss. I haven't found the shop yet. No, okay, let's, find, let's at least find the shop. Let's not be that bloody lazy. Oh, God. Shot right down the middle. What a whiff. Why are you a different color? What does that mean? Oh, hi. Thanks. Boop. I wonder if you use a battery. Like, if you use the book uh, multiple times in the same room, does it keep giving you a tears upgrade? Don't know. Very tempting. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put a bomb here, because we'll at least get some shrooms and we might get a secret room. Damn. Got nothing at all. Another gold key, really? Oh! <laughs> okay. Oh, how the hell are you alive? That's better. Buddy, thank you. Yoink. Mine. Now, I suppose I should probably give the mine to him at this point, because we still have enough for the shop, and we're probably going to get at least one greed... So, yeah, I'll try and remember to leave the money for him, the map. Mm, yeah, I guess we'll take it. It's not that great without the compass. I mean, it can be handy for, like, the wound one, whatever, because you can usually somewhat predict which uh, which way to the boss. Or, well, you know, at least know where the dead ends are, so it saves you, like, a room or two. Like this, I know we don't need to go down there. Why are you... Are you oh, yeah, you're exploding kind. Yoink. Tears down. You know what? No! I don't want to take that. You can keep it. It's fine. Thanks for the offer, though. I appreciate it. So where's the mod? Oh, it's called uh, Anti-Birth, or Anti-Birth, however you want to pronounce it. It's uh, a bloody huge expansion for the base game. And I do mean the base game because they haven't added the Afterbirth content yet. Carrion Queen, something, something, only 17, no, oh, yeah. You can dance, you can die in the time of your life. Ooh, oh God. Sorry, got distracted. So it's like new bosses, uh, new paths, new enemies, new items. And a couple of the new bosses that I've seen so far, holy shit, like, like really high quality. Like just as good as the regular game. And way harder in my opinion. At least so far, like, at least way more complicated. They seem to have a lot of moves and uh, movements and things like that. Hey, full health, didn't really need it, but sure. So, this will take us down to one heart. We have one guppy item so far. I mean, do, do we go all in on the gup? Do we do we try? I think it's Fuck it. Fuck it. We'll try and go all in on the gup. Ten lives, question mark. So if we get one more guppy item, we can become the gupster and do t t tons of damage. But now we need to start building our HP back up. Is this an HP upgrade? Damn. No, it's not. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. So we got one bomb. Still have infinite keys. Might be worth it. Well, no, those are dead ends. Uh, yeah. I'm just gonna. Well, no, 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 no. What we should do. <coughs> Excuse me. What we should do is go back to the uh, the bloody sword room over here since we can go in there now that we have one heart. Might be an HP upgrade or something really good in there. Could be complete shit. If it's complete shit, we can just ignore it and carry on. Great singing, I thought so. There's another pill down there. What was that? Was tears down? I think. Ah, oh, it's delicious. All right. Okay, I'll do it. Oh, just money. Why? Why do you hate the game? So then we gotta fight bosses. Pretty sure this is a boss room. Before I, this is how long I it's been since I played this game. I, I'm like questioning things that you know, I I should know for definite. Like, this, this is where you fight bosses, right? I think it's two bosses. And then, when you're on, like, the womb upwards, it's three bosses, I think? Something like that? Holy crap, man. <laughs> don't like the way that one curls around. Jesus. My shots don't exactly work unless you shoot them right at me, man. Okay, yeah, two bosses. All right, why one coin from that? Wow. I mean... We got some money. So at least, again, we can afford the next shop, assuming we don't get greeted. It's pretty likely. I just would like another guppy item. So we got a 69% chance for a deal with the devil right now. Sexy. Uh, I think it goes down to 33? I don't think it can go lower than 33. I could be wrong about that. Although maybe it does, if you get uh, get one when you are on 33. Let's have a look. I think it goes down 33% every time you have one on the previous floor. Something like that. 
So I guess if we were on 33 and we got one here, it would go down to zero, and then go back up to 33 afterwards, something like that? Uh, don't, don't ask me. Oh, what is that? That's very cool. Oh, it bounces things. It keeps going. See, again, that thing is completely new. This is what I mean. Like, that's some quality, like, work there. Oh, they got a little brick to stop it and everything. I wonder. I feel like this is going to be a secret room. It is. And we got two keys. Eh. Would have probably preferred bombs, to be honest, because we're kind of low on them. But, you know, I'll take what I can get. Let's go. That's quite a few large rooms. I uh, sure. Let's head towards the large room, I guess. Die. Let's see if we can meet this man. Oh, God. Didn't work it out at all. That's right. We have one heart. We need to be really careful. Really careful. Oh, hello, Tinted Rock. I almost missed you. Yay! Needed that. Sure, we'll do this here, even though against these enemies, not really going to help that much because we're just going to be using. Uh... I keep wanting to call him Bumbo. A uh, little brimstone. <laughs> get him, get him, get him! Alright, get him, Bumbo. Yeah. Uh, I will go in the curse room because we could get a guppy item in there. It's going to cost us one of our precious hearts. Shit! So confused me. Oh, come on! You're laying on my head. Guppy item! We did it. We became the Guppster. <laughs> Wait, what is this called? Book of Despair. Okay. All right, then. Um, I'm going to keep the paw. We've used the book enough. You know, it, it gives us a tears up. It's not the most exciting new item. So, I'm okay with that. This way, we can do that. And now, if we can get full soul hearts, we can unlock that Bethany character. And, you know, if nothing else, every time we respawn, instead of having one heart, we can just convert it instantly into three. So, this seems way better for our survival chances. This is pretty good. Yoink. Don't mind if I do. Alright, let's go back. Is this new music? I think it is, right? Yeah, it's definitely new. I will shut up so you can hear the music a little bit. Mm. Pretty cool, right? Um, yeah, there's like a thousand places the secret room, this the other secret room could be. So screw that. <laughs> oh crap! Kill the fat jumping man. Thank you. Ah! I just realized if we get the Polaroid, that will work really well. What we got going on here? Yoink. Hmm, tears. Tears up? I thought it was a tears down. I'm not complaining. I guess. Why was that music so weird when we entered? You give me a card. Thanks, buddy. The magician. Homing shots. And speaking of which, this is also homing shots. I mean, it's not horrible. But I'd way rather have the poor right now. Pretty funky music, man. Oh, come on. So taking damage. I want to unlock Bethany. Wish I could convert those, but no. Oh, my God. It's Tay! Okay, so they've changed the way they look. Th those things existed before. Not just the hollow, but like the one that drops the uh, the coins. But yeah, they definitely reskinned it. Give it to me, sis. I mean, it just gives us red hearts we can use. What are we on? Depths 1. Uh, may as well take this trick, I guess? I don't know that that's a good idea. I guess, well, isn't there a way of dropping it? Or did they add that in Afterbirth? Shit, I don't remember. Well, a... You know what, screw it, we'll take it. Oh, we got a new boss, Reap Creep. <laughs> okay. Okay, get rid of the wall spiders, man. What is it doing? What's doing that? Oh, okay. You see, like, this is new. How damn impressive is that? And terrifying. Oh, it spawns more wall spiders. What a dick. How do I escape these things? Jesus, God, man. Okay, I'd like you to die now if you could. Whoa! What kind of attack was that? Oh! 
What's he doing? Oh, he's making rain, rain spiders! I'm making rain, I'm making rain of them! Oh! God! I think I had the right idea there to dodge it. Oh, hello, Tears Up. I'll take you. Oh, look at that! I think I had the right idea there to dodge it, but uh, I was just a little, little too far to the left. Okay. You seem to have a bum theme with the new enemies. Ah, some of them, yes. Okay, that was terrifying. That was absolutely terrifying. Uh, let's go check out this last dead end over here, just in case it's like a uh, double key room or something. It is the shop? Oh, I thought we went to the shop. Glad I came back. Oh, those ones exploding the bullets. Damn it. Didn't mean to rob you, sir. Sorry. I let you hold two cards, I think. I'd actually rather have the Soha at this point. Yeah. I mean, I wish we could afford, uh, wish we could afford that as well. Yeah, 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 just do that. Will that hit the fires? It hit one fire. Well, it looks like it hit none. I suppose you got any money in the, uh... Oh, you do! <laughs> that was incredibly lucky. Hey, and now we got the extra card thing. And we got two of spades. Up as our keys, just use that now. 18 will be plenty for the rest of the game, I would imagine. Alright, let's go! That enemy was terrifying, indeed it was. You see what I mean? We've seen two custom bosses so far. From what I understand, this is just like the tip of the iceberg. Like, this is really impressive. Like, these weren't like, no, just like, basic bitch reskins. And you know, like, uh, often what you see with, with mods, and I don't mean this, uh, like, offensively, because I understand why they do it, uh, often what you see with mods is kind of the Frankensteining of existing enemies, because, you know, uh, they might not have anyone that can create new custom assets, like art assets. So they'll kind of just Frankenstein existing enemies together to make something look new. It's the chocolate, right? Mysterious candy. I think that looks different too. Are they reskinned that as well? Excuse me, I coughed again. Uh, yeah, you'll often see that they just Frankenstein enemies together to create something new and then give it a different name. They haven't done that with, you know, like the floating butthole thingies and... A lot of the enemies that we've seen, and especially the two new bosses, in particular that freaky spider thing, like that wasn't just like a combination of like, you know, the widow and something else. It looked completely new, it had completely new attacks. Very impressive. Let's buy this card. Do a spades again. Alright, I guess. Get out of here, Candy. Nobody wants you. Yeah. Die, you ghost bastard. Where are you? There you are. They don't call me Peter Venkman for nothing. I mean, they don't call me Peter Venk. Isn't Venkman just the best Ghostbuster, right? Like, surely, I mean, Egon, I can get it if you're really into, like, the whole nerd thing. Because he's got, he's got the nerd cred. But Venkman's the coolest one. I mean, Ray and Winston don't do anything for me, to be perfectly honest with you. To, to, like, I would say, like, Venkman easily, and then probably Egon, and the other two, eh. Take them or leave them. I was, like, so into the Ghostbusters when I was a kid. Oh, uh, okay. Yoink. Take the money! Take it! Take it! You whore! Thank you. Sure, let's go down here. Ooh, we found this treasure room. <laughs> Haven't actually seen that many new items? I know there's a lot. I don't know how many. Oh, it's got the $3 bill. By the way, the $3 bill is, uh... It's a gay joke. Not an offensive one. But uh, the idea, I think it's a, a, a phrase like gay is a $3 bill. I mean, you know, we don't use dollar bills here, so I'm just going on what I heard. Pretty sure there's a phrase called gay is a $3 bill. Because, you know, a $3 bill doesn't actually exist. And that's why it's pink and gives you rainbow tears. Because, you know, the rainbow is the, uh, I guess, the representation of the gay community. I don't know. Did you hear about that? Apparently. I think it was in Russia. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, it might be a different country, but it, it's certainly somewhere in the world. I think Russia. Uh, FIFA, I think, the, like, the newest football, soccer game, whatever you want to call it, was banned because you can give your football players rainbow laces and they said that it was, uh, basically pushing the gay agenda by doing that. And because they're so against, you know, homosexuality in that country, they banned the fucking game in that country for rainbow laces. How homophobic do you have to be? Like, holy shit! Hello, innovative mind. How are you doing, sir? Ah, uh, that's a dead end. That's a pile of balls. We have one bomb. Man, we have been just... Just bereft of the bombs lately. 
So we can go bottom left. There's a lot of play. Yeah, I don't like these odds. I don't like these odds at all. I'm just gonna wait. There's an arcade. There's some funky arcade music. Who's Venkman? The uh, the coolest Ghostbuster, played by Bill Murray. I'm just jamming out right now. I know you can't see it, but I am. As we'll gamble in the meantime, I guess. I don't want that. Get out of here. Blame. Well, I mean, I wish I had more money to gamble with, but someone robbed me. Bumbo. All right, let's go. Oh, hello. I forgot that it was this wench. Yeah. All right, we're not doing horrible damage. I mean, when the flies get in there, we do a lot. We ain't one-shotting her, so, you know, I'm never happy unless that's happening. Yeah. Let's see if we can just not take damage on this fight. Why do I have the time on the screen? Is it just me or do her appendages? Like on the whoa! On the walls seem to be disappearing way quicker than Oh hello, there's a tinted rock here. Stamp it. Stamp it. Stamp it. Stamp it. Stamp it. I wanna save my bomb. Stamp it. Ah you bitch! Wasn't worth it. Why did you stamp it? Come on! Where's the damn foot? This bitch! Fine, I'll do it. God damn. Alright, we've got an HP upgrade that we can trade to the devil. And... Do it. Yes! Bethany Getor. <laughs> Though I'd need to do that like really quick before I took some damage, because that would have sucked. So the second I saw there was no devil deal, I was like, yep, yeah, pop that damn thing right now. Oh, come on. Couldn't you give a brother the coal? I guess at this point we don't really need the... Pause, we'll take the, the head of Krampus. Is it still... No, oh, it's six charges. Oh, oh. I was hoping that we had, like, the old version that was three charges and opiates balls. I mean, it's still really good. But, you know, every six rooms instead of every three. All right, well, we absolutely destroyed that bitch. I'll let it go. Thank you, thank you. So I guess there's no rainbows in Russia. Apparently not. You feel bad you were, <clears throat> excuse me, you were going to carry on with your Dark Souls 1 co-op stream, but you all started streaming at the same time, so basically there goes all of your potential videos. Damn! I'm sorry, man, like, uh, I, I, I understand where you're coming from, but at the same time, like, put it this way, we have way less people in here right now, because a lot of them are either watching Overwatch, or are some of the people playing Overwatch with, you know, Kirsty and Reaper. It doesn't really bother me, I mean, as long as, as, long as <clears throat> I'm really losing my voice today, sorry. As long as there are people here, then, you know, it's all good. Plus... Obviously, I put my stuff up on YouTube anyway, so... And by the way, hi, hi YouTube, how's it going? Uh, I put my stuff up on YouTube anyway, depending on what it is that I'm streaming. So... I mean, I guess what I'm saying is... You should be streaming for you, as long as there's, like, at least one person there... Then, uh, you know... Then it's worth it, in my opinion. I understand, like, the idea of wanting more people, though, don't get me wrong. I mean, would I rather a thousand people were watching me? Sure, why not? Uh, get the get the coin, champ. There you go. We got another card. Thank you. Wheel of Fortune. Just pop that down. Blow it up. Oh, that's right. We don't. Well, all right. I'll gamble then. We don't have a bomb. See what he sees. Do what he does. Pretty sure that is a new fortune, which is probably a clue to a. Uh... See what he sees. Do what he does. Yeah, it's probably a clue to a secret or something. No, no. I think there are secrets in this. In the in the mod. Uh, but yeah. Speaking of which. Don't forget that Reaper and Kirsty are streaming Overwatch right now, so if you want convenient timing, Nightbot just put the Moit Twitch link in the chat. All you need to do if you want to watch Reaper as well is just add slash XX Souls Reaper XX to the end of that link, and then you'll be able to watch me, Kirsty, and Reaper all at the same time. You can have us all unmuted, all muted, you can mute one plus, you can mute all, you know. You can listen to all of our voices overlapping if you want, or you can just, you know, watch one person, listen to the others, blah blah blah. You can do whatever you want. So, yes, do keep that in mind. You think you get a few viewers that you have gathered from your own streams, but you just haven't streamed this week because, you know, you were sick. Yeah, I know. I, like I said, I understand where you're coming from. But uh, just just never forget, man. The more active you are, the more viewers you will accrue. Hello, BJ Dunbar. How's it going, man? The moon. Take us to the cigarette room. I agreed. I don't like you. I'm glad you didn't show up in the shop, though. Why do I have double shot now? Where did that come from? Oh, the $3 bill. 
I mean, I guess I'll take the steam seal. I suppose. Let's go this way. I want my car back. Ah! God! Oh my god, that was close. Should be looking for tent trucks. Yeah, like I say, I mean, we'd we'd all like more viewers, but you know, uh, it's one of the things when you're you know a lot of people that stream. Oh, that's new. Actually, they're all new, aren't they? What the hell is that thing? Hey, buddy. Oh. Okay. Guess it just dies when the enemies die. I don't think it took damage. Ah, uh, you know what? Let's do this. Oh, hey. This will open up the devil room, I guaranteed, I guess, so we can at least go to Satan, question mark? Wait a minute, we didn't get a Polaroid, did we? I guess I don't have the Polaroid or the negative unlocked on this, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, on this run. Uh, file, rather. But we are incredibly close. I think we only need, like, one or two more, uh, victories. I have to clear my throat, one second. Holy crap. Alright. Is that a double boss room? I think it is. Yeah, Loki double trouble. Die! <laughs> what the hell is that? That's new. What are you? Consolation prize plus one to lowest stat, which was... Range, I think? Hmm. It says plus 5.25. I don't know. I don't know what plus one means. Hello. Uh, Ron and Baby is good, but really not worth it with what we have. Well, actually, no. I think he is a lot better with, um, BFF. I'll buy... Why do we have a White Heart? Where the hell did that come from? Oh, maybe Constellation Prize gave me that? That's not an Eternal Heart, because an Eternal Heart's half, and it would be, like, at the the other end of my hearts. I don't know what the, I guess that's some kind of new heart. Or maybe they've changed the way Eternal Hearts work. I don't know. I'm going to buy this because it's damage up, is what I'm trying to say. Uh, it's a little expensive for for what we have. That's flying. We don't need that. And again, I don't think he's worth it. Though normally I would take him, but since we are guppy, I don't think it's worth the the HP. So let's just go down here without taking damage. Beautiful. Your character's changed so fast. Yes, we uh we are, we are quite powerful now. You don't play the bunny Isaac, but you look strong as hell right now. Yes, we we got pretty lucky. Mostly because we're guppy. Do these things take damage? No, I don't think they do. Okay, so is this just a case of me killing the other enemies? Yes. And then they plop down and blow up. Those are completely new, by the way. It's, like, really genuinely well done. On all the enemies and everything. Like, I, I am impressed. I really am. Anything for me, buddy? You got a bomb? Sweet thing. No, it's a troll bomb! Speaking of which, haha! Why'd I do it? Okay, we're fine. Go pick that up, champ. There you go. Aww. Oh, laser beams of death. Laser beams of death and hands. I hear hands. Oh, I walked straight into it. Oh, I suck. Okay. At least they turn off. Seems like a lot of the enemies that I thought turned off at the end of the rooms don't. Like the spikes. I thought they just deactivated. That could have been an afterbirth thing. I don't know. It dropped from the room before the boss. Oh, okay. So I just completely missed it. Uh, some card I guess I'll keep so I can see the floor later. Um, if I were a boss, I frankly would probably be at the top right. So let's just head that way. Die! There you go. Beautiful. Look how many freaking flies we have. And she's spawning spiders over there that they don't even get a look in. They don't even need to. Boop. Pick it up. Thanks, buddy. He knows what I need. He knows what I like. I'm his bottom bitch. He keeps me happy. He's my sugar daddy. Oh, thanks. Uh, trying to keep an eye out somewhat for the tinted rocks, but they're really hard to spot on these floors. I know what they look like, unless they've messed around with them. But I doubt they have. It's this specific rock type here. In the bottom right, there'll be a cross. It's like the only way of telling. Didn't mean to open that, but, uh, you know, whatever. Oh, there's a dime there. It's top of the line. Go get it. Go get it. There you go. Right, don't give me troll bombs. Regular bombs are good. Thank you. Just wait for him to drop all his crap. Don't want the remote. It's terrible. A full card. Eh, moon card. Sure, why not? And we get more money for him. I don't even know what I want at this point. We're kind of good. I, another bomb, it's alright. see if we can get more money. Damn. Alright. Well, at least we didn't have to fight our way out of them. What the flies do, they do, I think, 
two times your damage, so I think three because we have BFF, something like that. It's either two or three times. I think it's normally two, but I think three in our case. Uh, so each one of these shots, they do what triple what that would do, and uh, they spawn because we are the cat, because we got three cat items. So yeah, we're pretty freaking like when you become the cat, you are pretty goddamn unstoppable for the most part. Unless we run into new content. But I think we may have to unlock, um... Oh god. Damn it. I was hoping I can get over that. I think we have to unlock the cathedral and the chest properly to do that. But we are very close from what I can tell. I think we only need like one or two more Polaroid pieces. I think you get them from beating the heart or something? I don't remember how you get the Polaroid bits. So we could go in that chest, carry on. Or we could just go this way and go at least fight Satan. So I say we go give Satan a poke. And see what up. Boop. Experimental treatment has appeared in the basement. Is this new music? I believe so. That's cool. Alright, uh, boss is... I mean, it's either going to be on the bottom left path, like uh, if I can... That one there, or the one on the top right, top left rather. I'm thinking the, the bottom left one. You know, let's just use the sun card, bugger it. Aha! Yep, he is down there. Alright, let's go give Satan a spanker, shall we? Again, I am pretty rusty, especially with the Satan fight. But I'd be surprised with what we got going on here if we die. Like, something would have to have gone terribly wrong. Now, I'm not saying that can't happen. It's just, whoa, that's new. What are you? What do you do? Why are you purple? I don't understand. Definitely interesting music. I think I prefer the soundtrack so far to the regular Rebirth soundtrack. I mean, I, I've, I've mentioned it before, I was never... Oh my god, what the hell is that? Hang on, what do you do? He like swiped at me or something, that was awesome. I've never really been a huge fan of the regular Rebirth soundtrack. I way preferred the, uh, the original Binding Isaac soundtrack. Like, way preferred it. This so far, I mean, it's, it's interesting. Another coin for you, buddy. Ah. Holy crap! And super greed. As if we needed more money for the bomb. I mean, I'll, I guess I'll let you pick it up. I don't think it's gonna make a world of difference here, but you know, go for it, champ. There you go. A heart, a key. Oh, another card could be good. Hermit and the hangman. No, they are bloody useless. Empress is good though. Empress and... I don't know. Well, I suppose. See, I don't think we can go to... Uh, no, yeah, we definitely can't go to... What the hell? The chest? The dark room? The dark room, that's what it's called. We can't go to the dark room because we don't have the Polaroid. Or the negative, rather. Because we haven't unlocked it yet. But we are really close. Like I said, I didn't want to mess around with my regular file! Oh my god! Okay, pop up. I need you to pop up, man. Thank you. Alright then. How's that? That's new. Chewed pen, it's leaking. It's a new trinket, we'll take it. Hello, I should have kept the head for Satan, but eh, like I say, I, I don't think he's gonna stand much of a chance. Yeah, not really. Not really. I mean, he does have three faces, but uh, when you kill one face that quick, it's a good indication. Plus, we have shielded tears. Which is also helping out a great deal. Yeah, he's getting absolutely spanked. Just absolutely spanked. I can show you the world, shining, shimmering, splendid. I could sing the whole song, by the way, from Aladdin. I could sing, oh god, sing the whole thing. Tempting, very tempting. Does Satan's legs look different? Are they reskin these legs, or do they always look like that? I don't know. Boop, we did it. Thank you for watching the video, hopefully you enjoyed it, and if you did, a really great way to show your support is by clicking the like button, it will help to promote the video! And you can leave a comment, leave me some feedback, I always appreciate that. But as always, I just appreciate you watching! Thank you, and I will see you next time! Goodbye!